Happy New Year, guys. This is Mary. Welcome back to Cards TV. Today we're going to make a quick little New Year's card. Maybe there's somebody that you missed on your Christmas list and you want to send them a New Year's card. And that's what we'll be doing today using George and Basic Shapes. This is an older cartridge. In fact, this is the very first cartridge I ever got. And a newer cartridge, which is everybody's favorite right now, Teddy Bear Parade. For our sentiment, we'll be using the Cards TV Happy Day Stamp Set. This is everything happy on here. But right up here, we've got Happy New Year, so we'll be using that. And our papers are going to come from this Birthday Extravaganza Glitter Stack. I picked this up at Hobby Lobby about a year ago. And there's some really cute papers in here that you can use for birthdays or other occasions, too. Now, we're going to use a purple card base. You know, purple's my favorite color. <laughs> and this is a four and a quarter by five and a half inch card that opens like this. And to go on that, this is one of those little glittery papers from that paper stack. This is four by five and a quarter. We're going to add that to the front. That's really cute, just like that. And then, just for a little bit of a different look, I pulled another paper out. This has got little stars, purple stars on a purple background. And I lined this up in the channel of my trimmer and cut it on a diagonal. This was also four and a quarter by five and a half. And I'm going to just match up the bottom and the sides and add this to the front. And I've already stamped it with that uh, Happy New Year stamp right down here in the corner. So let me grab my ATG gun and get these on and then I'll show you what's going on this Happy New Year card. Well guys, I was in such a hurry to get this on the front of the card that I totally messed up. But luckily I was able to pull this loose enough. I was going to wrap this um, Baker's Twine around here. This is from the Twinery. And this is lilac, and it's really pretty. So I've pulled it up at the bottom, and there's adhesive on the back already. So I'll be able to go ahead and wrap this around about three times. And then I'm going to cut off a little piece and tie it in a bow. And then I'm probably going to have to take some glue dots to get my uh, mats stuck back down since I pulled them up. But see, even when you goof up, there's a way to fix it. <laughs> so let me keep wrapping this around. And then I'm going to go grab my glue dots and get this stuck back down. Alrighty, we've almost gotten this. Grab my scissors and trim this off. We all mess up from time to time, don't we guys? I mess up a lot from time to time. <laughs> okay. I will have to put some glue dots on here. Because it's not as sticky as it needs to be. And I'm going to cut off a piece. And run it through here and tie it in a bow. Right here where this diagonal piece comes down. Okay, I've got it all stuck back down, and instead of the glue dots, because I was afraid they might make it bulky under here and I wanted it to be smooth, I used some Scotch Quick Dry Adhesive, and it's holding it down just fine. So nobody can tell that I screwed up. <laughs> now, from the George cartridge, I've cut a star, and this star is on page 115. And this star was cut at two and three quarter inches. And here it is. And I used some glitter paper. And it's the same color as this glittery stripe that's running through this striped paper. I've got it on one thickness of foam tape. And I'm going to turn it at an angle and put it right there. And from the Teddy Bear Parade cartridge, look at this cute little Baby Bear New Year. I think he's so cute. I cut him out also at two and three quarter inches, and I used some more of that glitter paper for the band on his hat. 
and you'll find the bear is the first cut in the first column and the baby new year is the third cut down and I didn't cut all the pieces for mine I cut the hat but I didn't cut any of the little confetti pieces because at two and three quarter inches they would have just been too small so I just cut his hat the band his diaper and the band but my little baby new year bear is on two thicknesses of foam tape and he's gonna go right here on that star and there we go here's our finished baby bear new year card can you see all that glitter on there I think it turned out really cute even though I almost messed it up in the beginning <laughs> it was fixed and I did have to add a button you know me guys I untied that bow and ran a little button through there tied the bow again and I've got it secured underneath with a little glue dot but I think it turned out really cute and there's several people I need to get New Year's cards out to and I think I'm going to make some more of these and get them in the mail thanks so much for coming by today guys I really appreciate it I'll see you again really soon bye now <music>